Hey everybody, it is Nicole from Shape It Up Fitness. I hope everyone in South Jersey is enjoying this fabulous weather we are having today. It is so beautiful outside. I know I'm not outside right now, but I will be later on. So, um, thank goodness that heat wave has passed. <laughs> it was really hot. Welcome to another little Shape It Up Live show today. Um, I have just a couple quick little tip for you. Um, if you don't like food logging, you want to watch this video. If you are interested in turning your life around in six weeks, I have a brand new program that I just launched not too long ago, got some clients in there, and it is called Turn Your Life Around in Six. And you can request a free phone consult with me, um, and we'll just talk about it. And it is not for everyone, but you can check it out at Shape It Up Fitness dot com slash call c a l l um, I also left a link up above you can click on that too in the post so let's get into today's topic I am going to give you a little tip on how to navigate food without food logging it's very simple it's very easy and you can bring it with you everywhere you go um, it's your hands okay so what I want you to do is when you're looking at your plate of food or you're deciding on what you want to eat, simplest, easiest way to do it is take your hand and think of whatever protein you're going to have. So protein is fish, chicken, turkey, um, it could be um, shrimp, it could be any kind of meat, that kind of thing. I usually say anything with an eyeball is protein. Egg whites is also another. Um, eggs itself are um, protein and fats. Okay, so but what you want to do is you want to take your palm of your hand, get rid of your fingers and your thumb, and that is the width and thickness that you want to have for protein. So imagine just the palm of your hand. That is going to be the size of like your burger or your chicken, anything like that. Um, then you want to look at your fibrous vegetables. So fibrous vegetables are like broccoli, um, cauliflower, uh, zucchini, peas, anything like that. So when you're looking at your plate, you want to do two fistfuls of fibrous vegetables. If you're having like lettuce or something, you could probably get away with a couple more fistfuls. Um, you could probably double that, but ideally you wanna have two fistfuls of some sort of fibrous vegetables on your plate. Then you wanna go into your starchy carbs. So your starchy carbs are your pastas, your breads, your rice, your yams, your oatmeals, your grains, anything like that, quinoa. Um, you wanna have a fistful of the starchy carbs on your plate. And then lastly, for fats, fats are avocados, olive oil, coconut oil, um, even butter, anything like that. You want to have the tip of your thumb, just the tip of your thumb. So depending on your size of your finger, it's probably about a tablespoon, give or take. Um, and that is how you can look at your plate and figure out what kind of food, you know, how it should all kind of be organized on your plate and hopefully you are always carrying your hands with you at all times so you will have something to reference so one more time it's the palm of your hand for your protein so it's the no fingers no thumb but the palm of your hand width and thickness um, pork chops is another one I don't know if I mentioned pork chops um, and then two fistfuls of fibrous vegetables that's your broccolis, your um, lettuce, that kind of stuff. And then one fistful of starchy carbs, which is your pastas, your breads, um, your rice, whatever. And then one thumbful of healthy fats, okay? So try that out next time you're eating and try that for a couple days and see how you feel. Um, it does get a little tricky if you're eating stuff like lasagna or something like that, but I have more tips and tools on how to navigate those types of foods. Um, if you don't know when you work with me as a client, no foods are off limits. Some people are very shocked to know that, but um, I have a whole structured way that I approach eating with food, and um, ideally I don't have my client's food log. Every now and then I'll have them food log, but my goal for my clients is to never have them have to food log again. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in learning more about, head on over to shapeitupfitness.com slash call, C-A-L-L, -L, and you can chat with me, request a phone call, 
and chat with me and I will be happy to answer any of your questions and I'll tell you a little bit about the new program that I have called Turn Your Life Around in Six. So again, that's shapeitupfitness.com slash C-A-L-L. And that is all for me today. I hope you are able to get out and enjoy this beautiful weather. And I will see you on the next Facebook Live. Have a wonderful day. Bye.